It took over a century for the penny to drop and for our coins to be decimalised. By the end of this millennium, most of our measurements will be decimalised. I contend that the time and the date must be decimalised too. By replacing our uneven months and our pointless clocks with perpetual calendars and smarter clocks, we could solve many chronic social and economic problems. We already count years in tens, hundreds and thousands. Why not divide days by them too? The very odd and mystical seven-day week would finally be decimated. An even ten-day week would allow most jobs to be shared five days on, five days off. This would cut unemployment, increase productivity, deflate the economy, balance the books and bridge the gap between rich and poor. We would all be better off. A century ago, an Earth summit agreed to decimalise space and time. We have nearly remeasured space, but we've forgotten about time. Nostradamus predicted that time would end in 1999. I predict that decimal time will start in 2000.